Hi, welcome to performance testing using Neoload. Today we are going to see how we can record a simple flow. To record a simple flow, we will start clicking on this start recording button here or here. Let's start recording. Right. So there are few settings. Let's see what are those. Here you will be able to select the desired script name where the recording should go into is it init or actions this defines the uh, either web or sap gui start client is uh, the list of available browsers that are in the system identify as this is used to set the user agent okay so there are variety of uh, OS and uh, browsers available will be able to select any desired user agent okay so in advanced tab there are uh, different options for protocols two different modes that is proxy mode and tunnel mode proxy mode is recommended tunnel mode is used for uh, mostly uh, app mobile recording which is a native app right um, this is the embedded neoload certificate and this is used to enable the uh, network uh, log the network traffic right so let's start recording okay. i'm using internet explorer to record okay this is the recording bar right this is used to pause the recording stop the recording where the recorded uh, request and response should go into you'll be able to give the transaction name so let me give launch this is used to uh, pre-fill a transaction name and this is used to insert a rendezvous point okay so now i have given the launch so i'll start the recording right so i'm recording a sample application it's a jpeg store i will sign in say click sign in i'm feeding in the username and password login button say click fish let's say select a product I'm going to select an item I'm going to add to cart let's do the checkout here and I'm going to feed in a, a fake uh, credit card details click continue now let's place the order by clicking the submit button now the order has been submitted so we have ordered for one large angel fish and again go back to the home page just sign up now I will stop the recording now this is the post recording wizard 
uh, here it lists all the servers that we have recorded looks like only jpet store has been recorded here so i'll go to next and this is where we'll be able to uh, auto correlate um, all the dynamic variables that are present in this particular script for now i'm going to skip this either we can use the recorded think time or overwrite with a variable if we, talk, if we have created it i'm going ahead with the use recorded think time and click next and finish now let's see all the transactions have been recorded so this is how we do a simple recording